Aptiv has a very large display of uh, autonomous driving vehicles and vehicle technology here at CES. I'm talking to Jim Sizzleman. Jim, can you tell us a little bit about Aptiv technology and then perhaps we'll move on to your collaboration with Lyft. Sure. So the Aptiv technology here in Las Vegas this week is actually autonomous driving technology. It's called Level 4. Right. So that means it's fully autonomous. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're running these vehicles uh, autonomously through the streets. And they utilize a number of different sensing technologies, first of all, LiDAR, radar, and vision systems. Right. And all of this gets brought to a central computing system, and it's all integrated through a software set that actually plans the path through the course of the streets here in Las Vegas, and then safely, quickly, and autonomously get you to your destination. So we're talking about level four technology in this demo here. How close to that is reality? How long before we have cars on the road using level four autonomous driving technology? Well, in essence, you have it on the road today, right? Oh, this yes. is truly a level four uh, uh, product today. Mm -hmm. and it's not really a demonstration, right? It truly is uh, a car service, a uh, mm -hmm. first mile, last mile kind of car service we have right here in Las Vegas this week. Now that ends on Thursday, mm -hmm. but the intention is that uh, Aptiv will actually uh, join a major city here in the United States and actually utilize this level four technology for a true commercial service uh, by the end of 2019. I have to ask the question, have you been experiencing any difficulties out there on the roads? Well, of, of course there's always difficulties. We're not ready to launch today. Uh, but the difficulties have been very, very minor. And uh, they, they, we, we call these difficulties perhaps corner cases. So situations that are very unique, uh, perhaps even unique to Las Vegas. Mm. For example, if you have a traffic cop standing in the road and he is directing traffic, Today, the car would think that that is a pedestrian, pedestrian sitting yes. in the road. So that clearly is a corner case. That it's, it's solvable, and we'll solve that. But those are the kinds of things that you run into in this, in this emerging technology. In, in fact, I'm sure you're learning from these experiences as well, are you? Absolutely, right? We have a number of vehicles here uh, in Las Vegas. We have a number of vehicles worldwide. We drive these vehicles every single day. We accumulate miles every single day. And we see these kinds of corner cases every single day. Every time we drive, we see a new corner case. It's really that variable. And we collect those up and we address those one by one. Tell us about your partnership with Lyft. Well, the, the Lyft partnership um, really is uh, in so much as it's a, a, a partnership uh, for developing a car service. Mm -hmm. So, you know, we've completely focused on all of the technology, as we said earlier, yes. uh, but uh, we've now joined with Lyft to actually provide that new technology in the form of a taxi, if you will, yeah. here on the street. So they bring you know, their back end, their software, their app uh, to the vehicle so we can actually operate the vehicle like any other Lyft vehicle out there today. Well, I believe with this partnership, you've made a lot of people very happy by delivering them back to their destinations. Jim, thanks very much for your time today and good luck. I appreciate it, thank you very much.